Hello loves, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Devesha B. And on today we got something very simple and quick. Because honey, it was a weekday and I was not trying to slave up in that kitchen tonight. So we got us some very oh <laughs> succulent. <laughs> Baby, don't it just look good? Look at look at how it move. Oh, oh, look at that cheese. It looks so creamy and good. Stay tuned for the video. You you want to watch me make this. I know you want to watch me make this. Anybody can do it. So, we got our hamburger helper here, okay? Scrolling off hamburger helper. You can use whatever kind of meat you like, honey. If you like turkey, chicken. Uh, I said turkey, chicken. <laughs> if you like turkey, ground beef, chicken, ground beef, regular ground beef, ground chuck, whatever you like. That's what kind of meat you're going to use for this, okay? This is the twin pack, but I'm only going to use one out the pack. And we got us some broccoli. We got to have some green on the side, okay? With that, I have gone ahead and browned up that ground turkey. In my case, I am using ground turkey, so I go ahead and ground it up. I season. I put some onion pepper. I said onion pepper. Jesus, I can't talk. I used <laughs> some onion powder, the garlic powder, and some complete on there. And while going ahead and grinding it up, I go ahead and add my seasoning to the meat. I want that seasoning to get stuck on their meat because that's how more flavor get incorporated in every bite. You be like, ah, baby, it tastes so good. It tastes so good. Like, what is that? What is that? It's the seasoning stuck on the meat. Yes, how you make it stick? You do it dry, okay? <laughs> so, we're going to get that a nice little toss up. To that, we are going to add some milk. I eyeball it, y'all. I do not, I, I don't. I don't go by the instructions on there, okay? I put how much I want how much, and how I want it to turn out, okay? But sometimes the boss be lying, okay? So I do it my way. We add that milk on there. Gradually add the milk because the milk makes it creamier, okay? What we want is the creaminess. That's the key. And if you add it while you're um, at all at once, you know, you get the little dry crumbles and it don't mix as well you know so we gradually add that milk and we gradually add the water to it as well gonna get that another little mix okay mm -hmm. add that water boiling water okay we're going to add boiling water don't just add the the water off the refrigerator or the water out your faucet or the water out the bottle warm it up or something okay it need to be boiling so get at us Toss up, toss it, toss it. Mm -hmm. Move around, get to know each other, get acquainted. Yes. And we're going to add those noodles. And with those noodles being added to, I'm going to let it simmer for about 12 minutes with the lid on. Okay. With the lid on. And I'm also going to add a little bit more milk to my um mix here. My hamburger helper. Turn up hamburger here because maybe your girl using some good stuff, okay? It is a healthy hamburger helper because it is ground turkey and the type of cheese that I'm going to be using is not from a cow, okay? It's good, good though. It's really good. Put that lid on there, let that simmer for 12 minutes, like I said. All right, so we got us a, a nice little size saucepan. We're going to add us some broccoli. To my broccoli, I did add onion powder, garlic powder butter salt and pepper that was the only thing that i added to that pot okay oh and some water to coat the bottom you can also use some vegetable stock tastes delicious okay but tonight i just used water because i didn't have my vegetable stock on hand i ran out so we working with what we got because i was not trying to go to the stove you know how you get in to the house and you be like uh, -uh we just gonna have to make it work with whatever is here because i don't feel like going back out there though you've been ran around all day we're gonna make it work with that okay there was some roasted garlic powder that we put in there okay and you season to your taste your or to the ancestors tell you to stop or you hear your mama say baby that's enough okay you season the way your heart desire your soul desire you that's how you season Everybody don't season the same, but if you want it to have some flavor, you're gonna be a little heavy, like I be, you know what I'm saying? You'll be a little heavy, okay? There was some pepper there. Go add us some pepper. 
some pepper. I did not used to add a lot of pepper to my food, but lately, pepper just speaks to me. Pepper, yeah. <laughs> pepper, what are you? Okay, and we got us some onion powder. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shake it, yeah. <laughs> right? And now we are going to add us a little tablespoon or so of butter. Throw that on top, cause what they say, butter make it taste better, okay? Butter, do it, it give it that nice little creaminess. It, and I want, I, I, yeah, it give it a nice little creaminess. We gonna say creaminess, okay? Right, we gonna go back over here and check on this turkey scroking off, cause that's really what it is. It's not beef, it's turkey. It's turkey scroking off over him. Get that a nice little toss up, honey. Yes, yes. Stir it in. Stir it in. Make sure everybody got to meet each other. Make sure everybody got to meet each other. <laughs> everybody got to meet each other. Okay? Now, this is a little bit uh, unordinary because I'm going to add something to it. Okay? Now, if you was to get the deluxe box of this beef stroganoff, I think that it's mayonnaise that they put in that little packet because i got it one time and it was not what i thought it was gonna be and i was like hell no i ain't getting it again so i did not get it again my alternative is to use some cream cheese and i am using bio life bio life vegan cream cheese put me a spoonful of it in there to help it with the creaminess okay we're gonna mix that well in you know everybody got to get to know each other over here Okay? If your food don't know each other, you ain't did it right. I'm sorry, not sorry. Your food got to know each other. Every flavor needs to meet that meat, or every flavor needs to meet each other. Okay? That's how you get it popping. Okay? We're going to add some Bio Life shredded cheese. It's vegan cheese. Yes, I said it. Vegan cheese and some vegan mozzarella. Okay? We're going to put that in there. That was the last out of a little bag I had. I opened my other bag right there, as you can see. Mm -hmm. Pull that on top. Yes. However much cheese you want to, baby. And that that is the best vegan cheese I have ever had. That cheese is creamy as heck. It's good, okay? Don't doubt it. Try it. Add us some mozzarella on top. Some mozzarella. 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 Okay? Stir that on up in there. Yes. Yes. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. 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 Y'all, food really do get me happy like this. Like, well, I'm ta I'm, I talk like this for real when it comes to food, okay? Ain't seen anybody that know me. Anybody that know me. I, I get like, I get down when it comes to food. I get happy. Okay? Put the lid back on there. Let that cheese do its thing. Melt. Vegan cheese does take a little bit longer to melt, but it's all right. It's cool with me. Steam to get the job done. Here go our broccoli all nice and green and ready to eat. Okay? Come back over here. Cheese then melt it. Mm-hmm. Yes. Uh-huh. Yes. Uh-huh. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. They got to know each other. They had a good time playing today. All right, baby. Look, this is the finished product right here. Look, look. Yes. Thank you all so much for watching. Give me a thumbs up and subscribe to your girl channel because the like don't cost you nothing. The subscribe don't the subscribe don't cost you nothing. Look at my baby tanned it up. Peace.